Adelaide housing conditions in July remain quite strong with advertised stock levels still 16.9% lower than last year and almost 40% below the five year average. Adelaide remains the only capital still recording a monthly growth rate higher than 1% at 1.3%. The media has focused almost exclusively on interest rates and cost of living increasing. To put that into a national perspective, a 10% decline in the market would take national housing values back to levels similar to July 2021. What is seldom reported is the massive increase in equity through the recent property values growth. The market is also protected by record low unemployment and high levels of mortgage repayment buffers. Additional interest increases will more than likely move market conditions from nuts to normal and create opportunity to those who had been unable or unwilling to compete in the auction process to enter the market. Our advice is always buy real estate and wait, don't wait to buy real estate. You should be making decisions that support your long-term lifestyle goals as opposed to trying to pick the peaks and troughs of the market. For homeowners considering selling in the next 12 months, please give us a call to get our recommendations on maximising your situation. Thank you so much for your time today. I'm Angela Stenefit from Owens Cassidy Real Estate.